Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Dr. Darpan Kaur and I'm an oral and maxillofacial surgeon. In today's video, I'd like to talk about the very prominent but at the same time very neglected relationship between gum disease and cardio and cerebrovascular disease, that is, diseases of the heart and brain. Before we move on, make sure you subscribe to my channel for more content on medicine and healthcare. What does your body do in the presence of infection? It fights to survive. Presence of any disease means that the body produces more white blood cells to fight off infection. Sometimes you know you have an infection because of obvious signs and symptoms, other times they can be concealed. The absence of active and obvious symptoms of infection in gum disease makes it that much easier to neglect but at the same time that much more dangerous. Increased number of white blood cells over a prolonged period of time can cause our blood to become thick or viscous. Not only that, but the platelets in our body have a tendency to bind to certain bacteria specifically present in gum disease. This once again can lead to thickening of our blood. Thickened blood has an increased tendency to clot, which can lead to an occurrence of major thromboembolic events. Poor oral health has been linked with an increase in various coagulation factors like fibrinogen in our blood. Coagulation factors help in clot formation. And while clot formation is a means of preserving life, any imbalance in the normal workings of these bodily processes can prove fatal, leading to strokes or heart attacks. Studies show that people who experience bleeding from gums while brushing have an eight times more bacterial loads in their bodies, which puts them at that much more risk. Poor oral hygiene is a very large contributor of heart diseases, yet it is rarely ever discussed. Prioritize your overall health by prioritizing your oral health. Make that dentist appointment and then make it again after six months. If you like the contents of this video, please make sure you like and share and please subscribe for more content on medicine and healthcare. See you next time.